right, here for match six against uh, Burman. Um, hmm. This hand is so close. Hmm. Do I keep this hand? I know he's playing Tron. So maybe I can keep it? Alright. Well. I wouldn't keep this hand if I knew... If I didn't know that he was on Tron. But he's on Tron, so... Uh, brutal. Nope. Yeah, I think, uh... Okay, I guess I get to see more of his deck, at least. Looks like he's playing a Morasatron build. Alright, that's a good start. Discard all my signets. Alright, so, in terms of what, what the, what's actually going on in the game, um, ooh. that's not good. Yeah, I think I'll just concede this game. Is there any way out? Um, just got another signet. Nope. Alright, so that was a risky keep. So he has not a three, three, six. Uh, he has enough for double cap size. Alright, I'm just going to concede. Alright, so from the sideboard, Dispel, Pyro are all good. Probably want Retro Griffs. Probably also want Hydro Blast. So, what do I not want? I think Rolling Thunder is probably the worst of my cards. Hydro Blast just to stop his. Pyroblast. Probit's like pretty much the same. It just counters, counters his counters. I kind of want to put in another Wretched Griff. So one thing we've heard is that people like to side out for Ben Alchemy in grindy matchups. 
This is something I've heard X2 say, so I'm going to try that. I can side out one more for another hydro. And maybe I should do that if my plan is to just be very dense in terms of threats. Because the game might come down to that. So yeah, let's try this. Now I don't know what build he's on. So... Like I don't know if he has he's playing Dinrobas or anything like that. for me to do here but to <coughs> just keep on <coughs> trying to ramp up my mana. Alright, Bajuka Bog is scary. Let me cycle my aisle here. Ooh. That's not bad. I don't really mind if he counters this. Yeah, this is fine. And so I've ramped up quite a bit. Seagate. Alright, so it'll be a good time for a mole drifter. Nope. Alright. He found his own mole drifter. Um, I think I just need to preserve my life total here, maybe? Do I win the long game? I'm not sure. He's further away from Tron than I am. Alright, let me just play Expedition Map. Is that sure? It's not a big deal. I'm gonna hold on to Mortuary Mire. I think until I could bring back a threat. Probably like a wall. Alright, he's playing multiple impulses. Alright, now he's fairly close to Tron as well. That'll be bad. Prohibit? Eh. It's not great. Maybe I should be more aggressive. I should try to counter this. Just to use that as well. Alright. Alright. 
yeah, for a while I was on um, I was on memory lapse and and dispel. But I wanted to add rolling thunder for the challenge, and so I went down to one counter, and that ended up being a prohibit. All right, opponent hasn't found Tron mana yet, so all is not lost. Okay, this is not the worst. I'm going to get it back. And given that I know I'm going to have a griff soon, I'll start attacking. But yeah, hopefully both sides just have a bunch of reactive cards. And the Mole Drifter. It's not good. It's not the worst because basically I think this game will come down to win conditions, so decking more than anything else. Oh yeah, my friend also has Tron, which is very concerning. Let's play Richard Griff. Not a big deal, of course. Hmm. So, four mana. Yeah. So, no Tron. Nothing much is happening, so let's see. Is he gonna counter an impulse? Hmm. Now I could try to get Tron a line. I think I'll do that. If I take Ghostly Flicker right now, it would be good, but... I wouldn't be ready to fight over it. Hmm. Okay, well, that's not good. Yeah, I think I'll just evoke Mole Drifter. He can bounce two lands per turn. I 
This is not too bad because I have a long time to draw. This gives me a long time to draw an answer. I mean, I'm slowly dying, but I have a long time before I'm actually dead. Okay, Pyro, sure. I can do it, um, he can do it once more. Mnemonic wall, it's not good. Pyroblast. So if I find a pyroblast, I might have a shot. <laughs> yeah. Well, I think this game. Yeah, slowly I'm losing my lands, which is not good. <laughs> also drawing pretty poorly, but maybe that's... Let's see, did I cut? No. Nah. See how many times he can do... Uh, he can run capsize. Probably, this is probably my last turn to find, find like a pyroblast or something. Alright, GG's. Yeah, I think I'm just going to concede. He's going to bounce three more lands next turn, and that's probably going to not be too low. Even if I find pyroblast at that point, he could, uh, he could bring back, um, he could probably flicker something, counter it. Ugh, brutal. Yeah, I think, I mean, this didn't draw very well. Uh, yeah, well, I guess that's, that's the, uh, that's how. That worked out, I guess. This deck is good. I did um, I did post a, uh, I did win 18 games in a row, 18 matches in a row. So, um, I'm a little bit disappointed in these results, but it's kind of it's kind of variance, I guess. Plus, I I really lucked out the first time I played this deck. So, uh, yeah. Um, GG's.